Hello everyone and welcome to another highlight lighting tutorial. So today we're going to talk to you about our RGB plus tunable white LED strip. So the LED strip has a 6 LEDs every 100 millimeters, making 60 LEDs per meter with a 24 watt per meter power consumption. The chip is a Epistar SMD5055 in one. The brightness is 1500 lumens per meter. And with a 12 millimeter width, it's powered by three ounces of high copper flexible PCB, which allows you to maintain a cooler operating temperature despite the very high brightness. So the first connector that we have available is our strip to wire connector, which can be very useful if you have different cuts of the LED strip and you want to power them up separately. Now, what you want to do is to grab your six core cable and place it at the back of the wire side of the connector. Once you've done that and you're sure that everything is sitting properly, you're gonna grab a set of pliers and close the connector. It can be quite difficult to open the connector once closed, so please make sure that the core cables are sitting correctly. Now we would recommend doing a continuity test before placing the LED strip on the other side in order to make sure there is contact between the connector and the six core cables. So in case there's not continuity, you can grab a set of pliers and pull the six core cables until contact is made. Next, you want to grab the LED strip and with the correct polarity, you want to place it on the other side of the connector. You can then go ahead and close the connector. Lastly, make sure to test each channel before completing installation. Now, what we do have available as well is our strip to strip RGBW plus tunable wire connector, which you can use to join two sections of a LED strip together. All you will need to do is to clip the connector on one side of the LED strip that you want to join together. You will probably need a set of pliers to close the connector as it's quite hard to close by hand. Once you've done that, you can place the other section of the LED strip on the other side of the connector and then you can go ahead and test your strip. Don't forget to click on the like button if you like this video and subscribe to our channel. If you want more information, you can visit our website highlightlighting.co.uk and follow us on our Twitter and Instagram page to remain up to date with latest news. Thank you very much for watching and see you next time.